Hello, welcome back to another Max on Tour video. It's uh, It's been a fair while. Seven months to be exact, not ideal, but hopefully today, back with a bang. If you've never seen me before, this channel before, basically I'm clearly an Aston Villa fan, go home and away. My main channel is Villa on Tour. Like I said, go to every single Villa game. Um, but this is basically the neutral side of things. We all love going to the football, me and my mates. So this is basically a channel for all the neutral games that we go to. Today, promotion chase in Plymouth versus promotion chase in Sunderland. Both trying to get back up into the championship should be a good one. Plymouth haven't been in the championship for over 10 years. Sunderland, on the other hand, we all know what's going on there. They've had a couple of horrible relegations from the Premier League and then the championship, and they find themselves in League One, obviously trying to get back up there to the big time. Two groups of unbelievable supporters, though. Plymouth, I don't think they get the credit they deserve in terms of the miles they have to do week in, week out, because they are so far out of the way. Um, their support is unbelievable and so underrated. Sunderland, we all know they've got class support. The mission from Sunderland to Plymouth for this away day, unbelievable. Sunderland find themselves just outside the playoffs, whereas Plymouth are in there, but Sunderland do have a game in hand on Plymouth, so it's so, so tight in there, and this game could prove to be massive. We are in the Plymouth end today, though, behind the goals, so the atmosphere should be decent. I've got high expectations, should be a good one. Let's get cracking. Three and a half hours for us, long old journey, but uh, we're here. I've already seen a couple of Sunderland fans in town. Absolutely unbelievable support from them. I didn't realise as well, this game's on Sky Sports, which is mental. Um, seven and a half hour round trip, uh, no, 15 hour round trip for them. Unbelievable support from Sunderland. Should be a good one. We're in Plymouth, I'm on the boys. We used to have in pre-match drinks in the middle of a dark pub in the middle of Birmingham, but instead, we're here on the beach. Pre-match drinks, man, this is so lucky. To, I know the weather's not great, but pre-match drinks on the beach. Can't beat it. Bosh, we're in Plymouth, so. Yeah. Doesn't get much better, mate. What are we saying today? In the Plymouth end, you've got to fancy them. Yeah, I think it'll be a tight game. I think the two teams are quite close to each other in the tight yeah. So I'd like to see some goals today, so uh, I think I'm going to go for a 2 2. Ooh, Desmond, Ryan, what are we saying, know. mate? Ooh, same again, it's going to be a close game. I'm saying there's going to be goals galore. I'm going for 3 3. I oh. think there will be goals. That must mean now it's going to be 0 0. Yeah, 0 0, roll over. I tell you what, we got here and it was absolutely horribly cloudy, but we're here now. Unbelievable tropical weather. Simon's gone because he's gone to go get an ice cream. Look at speedboats, ah, the weather is glorious. Unbelievable, don't get this back home. I'll tell you what, home park, nice little stadium. Um, sort of gives you like scaled down Southampton Leicester vibes with like the, the main stand as well. Um, score predictions though, all Plymouth today, I'm going to go, I don't know, everyone else has said a draw, but I'm going to go 2-1 Plymouth, you've got to be confident, I think Sunderland probably need the points more than Plymouth, but massive game either way. <laughs> oh god, I'm massive! Everywhere they go! Oh god, I'm massive! Everywhere they go! Oh, 
Oh, how boring. Um, I've, I've seen more exciting halves of football. Um, goalkeepers haven't really had too much to do. I think Plymouth will probably have the best chance of the game. But it's really happening. I think if Plymouth shoot down this end second half, it should be a little bit more lively. But so far, a little bit dull. Hopefully, this does not end 0-0. Um, but come on the Plymouth boys. Come on. Come on then, the boys! There's a goal coming! Oh, this is weird. Oh my god. Oh my god. Ah, oh, what's that? Ooh, penalty shout not given. Lucky that is. Bad boy. Go on, lads! Go on! Oh my god, please, please! No! It's gonna be nil-nil. This is gonna be nil-nil. Jesus. Highlight of the afternoon Hello. is a Plymouth cat. Hello, Plymouth cat. Uh, Hello. You are a lovely Plymouth cat. You're coming home. You're coming home with us. You are. Well, after we made that pretty long journey, I think it was fair to say we all knew it would probably be nil-nil in the end. Um, it wasn't the most exciting game in the world. Um, lacked a bit of quality, really. I don't think either keeper really had to make too many serious saves. I think Plymouth had one towards the end where they probably could have done a little bit better. But I think a point was probably fair um, overall. I think both sides probably wouldn't be too bothered about a point as well. I think that's okay. I think it, I don't know if it sends uh, Sunderland into the playoffs or not. Um, Plymouth they'd probably take that for sure um, be interesting to see how the season pans out as well whether these two sides meet in the playoffs or how they get on in the playoffs whether either of them get promoted Plymouth as a place was really nice actually I've never been there before um, so that was really nice the stadium was really decent as well I said to the lads it would fit in in the championship like it's proper decent ground and um, the fans were good as well the Plymouth fans are really really decent I couldn't quite hear the Sunderland fans because they're obviously down the other end um, but they were decent they came in their numbers like I said earlier so credit to them if you have enjoyed the video though please do smash a like on it it's massively appreciated let us know your thoughts Plymouth fans Sunderland fans, share this video around, massively appreciated. And uh, yeah, let us know where we should go next because they're uh, interesting. Want to bring videos back to this channel, uh, want to bring it back to life. So uh, let us know where you want us to go. But hopefully, I'll see you very, very soon. See you in the next one. Ta da!